here in Abu Dhabi on Sadia Island is great because you have all these different cuisine and different restaurants we're going to have here. It's really um, a melting pot of different Arabic culture. So we really try to recreate all the best dishes from all this Mediterranean region we have. It's all about my background. You know, I grew up in Europe and food is a part of our table. You know, it's a part of growing up and having the freshest ingredients. And I moved on, traveling around the, around the world, and that passion st stuck with me. And each, each different region has something else to bring to, you know, to my proper development as well. And here has been a, in a great part of sandwiches as well, to have the freshest ingredients, the freshest produce, and that suits me very well. Because that is really dear to me, and as well to sandwiches and his guests. The market is a great way, again, to see everybody in the morning. You know what time they're coming in. At five o'clock in the morning, you have the fresh arrival coming in. The good part of it is you get the relation with the suppliers. They know what, you know, what you're really looking for. And that connection makes it great. You know, you can come back and forth. They see you from far away, as you have seen. You know, they hold you over. And they, they, they're passionate as chefs. You know, it's a little bit in the same business we are. You know, they're really passionate about their crops, where they got it from. And uh, the same thing as a chef, to put, when you have that pride, to put it on the plate afterwards. What we have, it's called Zata, and it's basically the, the local time. The only thing is, it's just very fragile, so you have to buy that daily. It's a produce, it's really that, that flavor that, not too intense, is pretty discreet, so you can use it in quite different recipes, and that's a part of the culture here in the UAE. The fish market is a great spot actually to meet actually the suppliers itself. I have the fish monkers there at five o'clock in the morning to see when the fish coming in, the right products to see, I check the gills, the freshness of the produce itself. And you know exactly where it comes from. You know, I asked any fisherman, I said, look, the shrimp, where they come from? They know exactly what time they were fished, how long they've been here. So it's really important to be early as well in the market. And the, the, the quality is there. What's important is to get this quality and to double check and they, they see that people following through as well. What's so important to us is get the freshest fish possible. The Bloody Mary, we have it basically, it's a part of the culture from sandwiches. It's really a whole part of the history from New York from the beginning on. And we did basically created our own one. Bloody Mary's the base is always uh, tomato juice. And we enhance that with our lemon. We did confit of lemon, we did we dried the za'atar, basically fresh spices, and have just added a spring on it, a dash of uh, Tabasco, another dash of uh, Worcester, and basically quite a little dash of cumin as well, because that's another local flavor who is involved in that. And we have sun-dried tomato on top of it. Date is really important and tea is really important to the local market here. It really makes you welcome to our home. That's the first thing you get if you go to a local house. So that's we integrated that part of it in our sandwiches culture as well, because it's really a welcoming. And the date is really important to get the right quality, because people really know, they taste them and they know which one is good and is not good. So it's really high uh, to have the highest grade possible to please everybody. Here in this scenery in Olia you have, I think it's a fabulous layout. It's greatly designed to have the freshness of the ingredients on one side for your breakfast, for all your cold food, with the cold mezze, fresh cheeses and all. On the other side you have your rotisserie station, where it's basically a whole Asian counter. The second counter we really dedicated to all seafood. The third corner is only Mediterranean, with a fresh pizza oven and you have your pita breads. The last section on the end is only Arabic, and you have a little robataya grill, where you have your fresh, your fresh little skewers. You have your, uh, your Josp oven where you do roast directly in front of the guest. Uh, you know, it's fabulous. Mm -hmm. 